Methods. The study relies on Anderson's behavioral model as a theoretical framework to analyze data from 1998 and 2008 rounds of a national household survey, assessing levels of utilization of 14 dependent variables across income quintiles and calculating concentration indexes as summary measure of inequality. Concentration curves compare the evolution of inequality during that time. Decomposition analysis identifies the most relevant contributors to inequality. Physician services are analyzed as the probability of having at least one physician visit during a year and the number of physician visits attended during the same period. Hospital services are analyzed as the probability of having at least one hospitalization, the number of hospital days during the last hospitalization, and the number of hospital admissions. The formal two variables are broken down according to their financing source, either public or private insurance. Results Physician services present very low inequalities, although a statistically significant positive gradient persists in both survey years. Publicly financed hospitalizations are a rare phenomenon among privately insured individuals and strongly concentrated on the poor. Most hospitalizations on the study group are financed through private insurance and they are very concentrated on the rich. Premium value and income are the most relevant contributors to inequality. Conclusions Private health insurance increases utilization levels of physician services, providing comparable access across income. Nevertheless, private coverage does not ensure hospital service to the poor in correspondence to their health care needs. The private health insurance agency could provide incentives to insurers to offer affordable private insurance with ambulatory care-only coverage, increasing access to physician service to the poor while not inducing them to pay for private hospitalizations.